Government is not a drain on the economy, for it is part of the economy. In many ways, businesses and government are interchangeable, since both provide goods and services, and neither is necessarily better at providing such goods and services. Money flows to businesses and the government alike. Money flows to businesses in exchange for goods, for example, a television set, and revenue flows to the government in exchange for goods such as highways. Money can also buy services like insurance from businesses. Revenue can also likewise provide retirement insurance from the government. Funds also flow to businesses from the selling of stocks and bonds and from taking out loans. Government funds can also be derived from the selling of bonds and certificates and from taking out loans. In all these cases these are investments in that a higher rate of return is expected. Money flows out from businesses for wages and for supporting businesses. Likewise money flows out from government for wages and supporting businesses such as a highway construction firm. Investors and lenders need to be paid back by both business and government. There is one notable exception to the similarities between businesses and government in that most businesses have taxes to pay. This is not a drain, just another pathway for money. Government operations such as levy construction are desired by the people as has been expressed through the ballot box. Sure this demand could be met by private enterprise but they would need to be paid just the same. Just substituting one for the other. Governments at all levels are not a drain on the overall economy for they are a part of the overall economy. Bye.